I think what we're trying to do in this film is to um, present him in all the different lights that he was seen, at, seen in. You know, he was, uh, he was a warrior, he was a prince, he was a leader, he was a fighter. He was a, he was a family man. He also, he had, he had a family, he, he loved his wife. Um, he also was a very fair ruler. Um, and he was a man who stopped the Ottoman invasion of Europe. He stopped it dead in its tracks, which is a historical fact, you know, in this tiny little, uh, little country, you know, he actually was the man and the army that stopped it. This isn't about Vlad the Impaler. This isn't about the bloodthirsty, sinister character that history has portrayed him. This is, a, this is the side of him that um, people might not know about. It's a story of torment and sacrifice and love and heartbreak and um, and extreme huma humanity. There's a lot of humanity in this story, which um, you wouldn't expect from a story about Dracula. And that's why it's different. It's about the human emotion that drives this story. From the second you meet Vlad, you, you, you see a human, you see a man with emotions, with care and love and, 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 and violence and power. Um, there's a lot driving this man and he, has to use all of them in equal measures throughout the film. It's part of the main reason why Vlad chooses to do what he does in the film is because of this love, this undying love he has for his wife. She is his half of his soul and um, Sarah Gadden, who plays Morena, does the most exquisite job of um, making me fall in love with her every time we do a scene. It's quite wonderful. To take on a role that is sort of uh, comes from history, so I'm playing a historical character. It's just it's incredibly exciting to to merge fiction with fact in a in a historical story. It's very very cool, very very cool. Gary and myself, we both want to present this character in a different light. We want to shake it up and we want to bring a new image to people's minds and we want to leave them with a new image of Dracula, something that will stand up to all the other Draculas, all the other looks that we are so, with that, so synonymous with that name. And now this is our turn to give, them, give this man a new mask. Hey, what's up everyone? Valerie here. An interesting movie fact from The Hunger Games. Did you know that while horsing around on set, Jennifer Lawrence accidentally kicked Josh Hutcherson in the head, knocking him out and resulting in a concussion? Ouch. I'm sure after this, Miss Lawrence learned that there's time for work and a time for play. That's all for today. Subscribe to keep up to date. Ciao, ciao.